Welcome to Moo Math. Today we're going to find the area of a sector. Okay, so what's sector? A sec sector is what I call a pizza slice. So if you have a large pizza and you slice out one part of it, it's that one area of that whole section of the pizza. Now it's a fairly simple equation. You've got your pi r squared in there for the area of the whole circle. And then n over 360 just gives you the fraction of the circle that you're dealing with. So n is our degree measure of the sector. Okay, so let's go down and start plugging in things. So to find the area, we need the angle and we need to know the radius. Well, in this problem, we see that the angle is 60 degrees. So if you think about it, that's one sixth of the circle. And then our radius is 18. So let's do some plugging and chugging. I'm gonna plug in 60 for n. And I'm going to plug in my radius is 18 squared. So let's first figure out the area of our circle. So we're going to take 18 and we're going to square it. So the area is 324 pi. Now let's think of it, whoops, 324 pi. Now let's think of this 60 degrees over 360. That reduces to 1 sixth of the circle. So now I'm going to take 1 6 times 324 pi. So 324 um, on top is going to give me 324 pi because you just multiply straight across. And then the denominator 6 times 1 is 6. So I am ending up just dividing 324 divided by 6. So that ends up being 54 pi. And that gives us the area of the sector. And so in this problem, we can see that we have one sixth of the area of the circle. The area of the entire circle is 324 pi, right? That would encompass all of it, but we only want a fraction of it. So we multiply by the fraction, which to get the fraction, we take the angle measure out of the whole circle. We know a circle has 360 degrees. And that's how you figure out sector area.